hello welcome back all today in this video we are going to discuss about onboarding panel in Odoo version 12 so many of the people will get confused which is onboarding panel that we have mentioned so if i go to the invoicing so currently in the database accounting modules that is invoicing module is already installed so if i take the invoicing menu you can see a blue color thing that is this is the onboarding panel that i am talking about so you can see you can configure the complete data invoice layout payment method and sample invoice from this onboarding panel so how about if you configure these things that is if you configure the company data invoice layout payment method and sample invoice and if you mark this as done this onboarding panel will not get visible again so i'm not going to configure these things right now so if i click on let's start you can see you have the option to add the company logo here so i'll just click on apply you can see it's done then i can have the option to choose the invoice layout so i'll just choose this and then click on apply so that's also done so it's not getting to done because i haven't added company logo company tag and all so like this if you add everything it will finally we can move it to the done state so right now i'm not going to move complete all those steps and move it to done state i'll just remove this remove configuration tips do you want to remove this configuration panel so i just click on remove button so it has got invisible so if i again come back to the invoicing you won't see that onboarding panel so recently many people are asking how to bring back that onboarding panel so someone might be completed all those configuration and they will mark it as done so here right now we will just close that configuration by clicking the close mark in the top right corner so let's see how we can bring back that configuration panel again so the answer for the question is by default there is no option to bring it back in the user interface so then you will think how we will bring it back so there is a little workaround that by that you can bring it back so if i go to the settings currently you can see by default the developer mode is activated in the system so if i go to technical and if i go to the fields so it is fields yes here is the fields and if i search for account invoice yeah you have a field name called account invoice onboarding state in the model companies so i'll just copy this field name so there is a selection field you can see the type of the field is selection field in the model companies so i'll just go to the companies form view from here right now in my database there is only one company that is your company i'll just open this and as the developer mode is activated you will, you will have the developer tools at the right side of the screen so i'll just click on it and i'll click on edit view form and i'll just add the field we have seen that is account invoicing the field i am not remembering exactly the field that we have copied so if i paste it somewhere here i can get the name that is if i look at the name you can see the field name field name is account invoicing onboarding state so we have to make this field visible inside this form so that we can make changes change we can make the values change so i'll just scroll down and i'll just add that field here inside this group so i'll just add that field here that is field name equal to i'll just paste what i have copied earlier so that's done so i have added account invoicing onboarding state to the field model sorry in the corresponding view and i'll just click on save button and i'll pause it and i'll just reload the screen so that we will get that field visible here so right now in the start early starting of the video we have just removed the onboarding panel which was available here inside the invoicing so you can see currently that field that is that selection field has been get visible and here you have the selection like not done just done done closed and we have four values and currently it is set to closed so i'll go to invoicing and if you check here there is no onboarding panel so i'll just go to the settings and then to the companies and what i will do is that i'll just change this state to not done so just save it and if i go to invoicing again you can see it has get visible so this is the workaround by which you can bring back the onboarding 
configuration panel so that's all about the thing i will just remind the video once more so what we have done is if you close this by thing if you close this the field value get changed into done sorry into closed and if you configure all these things the field value will be done so once you close or everything is done this onboarding panel will not get visible so if you need to be visible what you have to do is that you have to make the field that is field name is if i place the mouse over it you can see the field name is account invoicing onboarding state you can just edit form view and you can add this field inside the form view so that you can just click on edit button and change the value accordingly so if i if you place the value as not done it will get visible here so as right now it's not done the onboarding panel is visible here so if i go to settings and if i change the value to the closed or if i change the value to done sorry i'll go to the companies and from here if i change the value into done or closed you won't see that onboarding panel there so if i go to invoicing again it has been cut invisible so this is how or this is the way this is the only way that you can bring back the onboarding panel which was done or closed so that's all about this video if you like our videos you can just like it and we will request you to subscribe the channel and press the bell icon for more notification regarding upcoming videos thank you